What up guys, it's Jude and in this video, I'm going to walk you through step by step how to buy USDT on WITX through their P2P. I'll also show you how to make cryptocurrency deposits directly into the funding account or the funding wallet like I talked about in the other video. Um, use this money you made um, to trade in the spot market and show you how to claim the $5 I talked about in the part one of this video. So this is the second part of the how to trade on with X video. I highly recommend you watch the part one before coming to this one so you don't miss anything. There I showed you how to easily navigate the platform. The link is in the description. I believe you are going to enjoy this video. I made it really, really simple. So what you can do now is to support the channel give this video a like it is very important you do so and also subscribe and hit the bell icon and let us get started so guys i want to do this video using my phone because i know most persons use their phone to perform this action so this is a web platform and i'm just logged on with my phone so now I want to get Naira into WITX. I want to buy USDT using Naira from my bank account. So what I do is, is to click on this top menu here and watch guys. So these are the menus that I explained when I was, you know, walking you through and the parts one of the video um, on my laptop. So this is the phone. It looks the same way guys. So what I would do is to click on this buy crypto here. But first, if you want to trade in the P2P markets, you have to come to this account here, then click on verification and complete at least level two verification to be able to trade in this market. So let me go ahead and click on buy crypto now. Then you can see express, you can see P2P trade, you can see buy and sell. And of course, we want to buy crypto. Then you can see you can buy USDT, BTC, ETH and OKB directly with your Naira. Now, let's say I want to buy 50,000 Naira worth of USDT. If you check here, the first one is what is available is 1.1 USDT. And that is between 630 to 636. And I want to buy up to 50,000 Naira, which means I have to use this second person. I have to buy from this second person that has completed 123 orders right so if i want to buy a particular amount and i don't want to waste my time flipping through what i could do is to click on this filter here the filter at the top right corner then i can just enter the amount of crypto i want to buy so in this case you can just type in five thousand naira click bank account click confirm then it will just filter and show me only the persons that you know have what i want to buy if you look at the second person h uh, Bex, you can see he has done 10,000. It's one trade. This is really, really impressive, right? The first person has done 123 um, trades. Yeah. So, and again, you can also see that the first person is the cheapest. It's staying at 57950. The second person is 57981. I think you want to buy from the second person. Um, yes, yeah, so I can go ahead and click on him. Right, so I'll click on buy USDT. Mind you, you, can have a, you mustn't buy from the second person. You can buy from anyone you want to buy, right? So I'll go ahead and put the amount I want to buy now. So in this case, 50,000 there. Then it's going to give me $86.23. But bank transfer, that is what is selected. Yeah. Then I'll click on buy USDT. So um, this is more like a review and everything checks fine. I'll click on continue. So it's showing me the person's account detail. I'll go ahead and make this transfer into this person's account. Now, when you're making transfer into the person's account, make sure you don't include words like Bitcoin or crypto or anything of such. Just write only your name in the account description. So I'll go ahead and make this transfer into this bank account. I'll come back to this video. So I have 15 minutes and I've spent two minutes already. Let me go and make this transfer. So guys, I have made the transfer into his bank accounts. What I'll do now is to click on, I have paid. Next step. Then confirm by clicking paid. Then I'll just wait for um, the 
seller to confirm the payment. I could click on remind to confirm. So this will probably send the reminder to the seller to confirm the payment. All I would do now is just to wait. I could also come here where you see contact and chat with the seller, or I could click on this phone icon here to give him a call. All right. So the seller has released a crypto. I now have it in my asset. So if I go to my asset here, you will see that I have 86.23 USDT. So that's how you buy or get um, USDT into your WITS account. If you want to sell, the same process, go there and do the opposite, which is the selling. Um, you can see that this money that, that I brought in is in my funding account. So this is my funding account. This is my trading account. Let me show you how you get, you transfer or deposit USDT from an external wallet into your um, with X wallet. So if I click on deposit here, now in this case, I'm not buying with fiat. I just want to deposit from another wallet, right? So I click on USDT. That's what I want to deposit. I have to choose the network. Now you have all this network, TRC, ERC, OEC, Polygon, and Solana. Now I have it in TRC. Now I think the network fee is just $1. So I want to deposit that. I click on confirm. Then so this is the, it's a warning that this is the, I should only send US to this account. Yeah, so deposit to funding account. I can deposit to funding account or trading account. So this is the address I want to deposit to. Right? And it's coming to funding account. So what I do is to copy this address by clicking copy here. Then I just go to where I will make the deposit. Say I want to deposit $50 worth of USDT. I just click on done, transfer. This is from Trust Wallet. So this has gone. So I should see the $86 plus $50 in my assets um, section. That's my wallet. It might take a little time. So I just wait for it to come. So this has landed and now in my wallet and I have 136.23 USDT. Let me show you how you trade in the spot market. Mind you, the, the money now is in my funding account. So use it to trade. I have to transfer it to the trading account. So I'll click on transfer here and transfer. So I want to transfer um, USDT. I click on that from my funding account to my trading account i select the amounts i want to transfer in this case i want to transfer all so i click that and i click on transfer so yes it is now in my trading account so i click on menu then go to sports to trade it say i want to buy solana for example right uh, you see it's almost the same thing with the web platform so this is the market, BTC, USDT. If I want to trade on that coin, I just go here and search for it. Let's say I want to trade Solana. You can see Solana, USDT, right? Then um, I want to buy. I go down and click on buy. Solana is currently at 99.13 U dollar per Solana. So... I could enter here the say i have 136 dollars right i could enter it here and over here it shows me the equivalent um what is going to get me in solana right also i could set the price i want to buy at let's say i want to buy at a lower price i could enter instead of 90 i could enter 89 so what this means is that i'll say enter maybe 136 here what this means is that the order is not going to be filled. It will wait until Solana drops to um, one to drops to $89. That is when my order will be filled. To do that, that's why you're using the limit order. If you just want to buy immediately 
I have to choose the price at which Solana is and buy. Or I just click on market here, then just enter the say one thirty dollars. Then I just click on buy. It's going to, it's going to go straight ahead and just buy um, Solana at the best price available in the market as at then. So let's say I want to buy. Okay, let me leave it at this ninety dollars. Then I click on um, I want to buy say one thirty dollars worth of Solana. Right, so what I do is to click on buy so confirm. So my order is successfully placed. If I click on this X here, right, and go down, you can see that my order is placed. It has not been bought, it is placed because my order, the order I set is above the market price. I'm going to buy below the market price. I want to buy at 90.584. The market is currently at 90.874. So the market has to drop to 90.584 before my order is filled. Now, my order is not filled yet, which means that I can actually cancel it, right? And maybe put it at a, at a different price if I want to buy at that. All right? So you can see that while we're talking my order or the market has dropped to 90.5 below that so my order is now filled if i go to my assets i click on my assets you will see that i no longer have usdt it's still showing me the equivalent here yeah? what i have in my trading account if i open it is solana 1.4342 solana i can choose to actually what transfer this solana to my funding account and send it to an external wallet if i want to or if i choose to so guys this is how you use with x you can see it's really simple and it's straightforward and anyone can use it and i did this using my phone mind you the trading fee on with x is 0.06 percent which is really really small now how do you claim the five dollars right if you just watch the tutorial they say five dollars for grass but it's only if you are among the first 100 persons to watch this video and take action i'll talk about it before the end of this video that is it guys we have come to the end of this video if you have any question let me know in the comment section below also join us on telegram and join and follow with x on their different social media handles i will leave the links to this in the description box if you have any other exchanges you want me to review let me know in the comment section don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any of my content. This is really important. Now, there's a channel I subscribe to and I miss an important content because I did not hit that bell icon. So it is really important you hit the bell icon. Finally, support this channel, support this video, give this video a like. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. <music>